I'm Siobhan Kavanagh from the Signpost Programme and I'm here at the Ploughing today joined by James Rambo, a technologist from Johnstown Castle. James is demonstrating the Flux Tower, so James you're very welcome. Can you explain to us what's the Flux Tower about? Thanks Siobhan. So the Flux Tower is uh, monitoring carbon dioxide, okay? So carbon dioxide into a system, carbon dioxide leaving a system. So we call that net ecosystem exchange, okay? So I suppose... Just break that down now into farmer's language. What okay. does that mean actually? So. As a plant grows, it photosynthesizes, okay? So during the day when there's light, it pulls carbon dioxide into itself, okay? To produce simple sugars, etc. During the night when that sun goes, then that CO2 gets re-released, okay? But during the day, it's grown a bit, okay? So it's absorbed some of that carbon. Over time, it sheds that carbon, okay? As that carbon gets shed, it gets locked into the soil. That carbon that gets locked into the soil, we can call sequestered, and if left undisturbed, I suppose, that carbon builds up in the soil and the amount of CO2 in the atmosphere reduces. So ultimately, we, that's where we're trying to go, reduce the amount of CO2 in the atmosphere. Okay, so farmers are interested in carbon sequestration because it, they want it accounted for in their, their emissions. Yeah. So why should farmers come to the sand? Like, where's the benefit for them ultimately? Well, look, typically I found that a lot of people don't see, the aside from the monetary benefit that might come down the line in terms of a carbon market, um, farmers need to understand that, that carbon is an essential, essential nutrient for the soil, okay? So it helps in water holding capacity, it helps in soil structure, uh, it helps, it, it's an essential nutrient for plants to grow. So, you know, aside from the monetary value that will come down the line eventually, it's essential to have in the structure of your soil. So it's not just about sequestration for the for the carbon farming exactly. benefit, it's for production. Absolutely. All right, thank you, James. Come and join us at the Chagas Stand, row 21337.